there during a time of need. Everyone has a story. All of a sudden, Amanda, what time was it? About seven o'clock? Seven. The sky was like a daylight, like pure daylight. And then the phone start beeping, 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 beeping. And then that's when it, I think it hit Araby. Tuesday's tornado devastated Araby. It is so close to here. And like I said, this is our home. So, you know, uh, we got to take care of our people. Now people near and far are stepping in to help the community get back on its feet, like Cindy Geo. When he got here to work yesterday and he realized how close we were to just devastation, he got on the phone. He's like, well, Cindy, what you doing the next couple of days? She's cooking up gumbo outside her husband's shop to feed residents and first responders. Because they work those long hours and they don't they don't have time to go grab a bite to eat. While a hot bowl of gumbo helps warm the soul for others, it's the little things. Help yourself. Aid stations across Araby are set up to provide those basic necessities to residents who have lost everything from Tuesday night storm. Even now, items are still arriving to these stations. They've got buckets and bags filled with items just to help people get by like disinfectant spray and gloves. If there's an item you need, chances are they have it. Allison Barrios with the Old Araby Neighborhood Association says her home was spared. She feels lucky and lucky enough to help out her neighbors. We um, we made out OK and uh, we just want to give back anything we can. It's just great to be able to help people. Local businesses are also helping by cooking up meals for those without. Early that morning we made 175 sandwiches and then at noon we donated some uh, macaroni, some green beans. Cheeseburger pool boys, we did some cold sandwiches also. Yesterday evening we provided, uh, I think it was like 320 uh, meatball and spaghetti dinners. It's not going to rebuild a house of course, but it's just a little bit of a, of a feeling, hey, somebody does care and we do. It's a community in need where goodwill is a domino effect. Reporting in Araby, Olivia Vidal, Fox 8, Local First.